Hello there, it's me, Stuart Zagnett, the voice of Professor Oak, and you're watching Poke Collection. <laughs> Welcome back to Pokemon Collection. I'm back with the Sword and Shield Rebel Clash Elite Trainer Box featuring Cooperger, Giant Gantamax Cooperger, I think. Cooperaja? I don't know how to say it really, so I apologize. Um, I have to lend my. Um, I have to get the pronunciations properly uh, from uh, the anime, but that hasn't started airing yet in English, so um, we'll, we'll wait until I. But thanks to my friends at Card Merchant for sending this. Chloe and Matt, they also sent um, l little chocolates. Uh, a milk chocolate, dairy milk, Freddo, and a a caramello koala, which I think is Australian. I don't think you can get that here. Um, so thank you. Those little touches that you send me in these packages really actually cheered me up because this particular week that I'm recording this particular opening, it's been a rough week for me outside of Poker Collection. Um, just many, many things going on um, in terms of professional life um so it's being a bit lifey at the moment um and this arrived at just the right time it was actually more the chocolate and the the fun the very courteous and considerate disinfectant wipe that really cheered me up more than the elite trainer box itself which i know sounds really silly and terrible as a pokemon fan but um hello there i don't know who that was um but yeah it, it's, it's really brought cheer to my set cheer to my day so thank you chloe matt you guys i love you uh anyway so rebel clash um this is the f not the final rebel clash opening that i have but it's the final of the lot of rebel clash openings that i have in the initial release of it all so um obviously when i when i when i start a new set i have tons of openings and that's the initial sort of stuff that i get pretty, pretty much every single product variation and then that's done, and then it's just kind of like occasional openings of that every now and again after that. So um, it's been so good. It's been really good so far. Um, I have to say, across the board, I've not been disappointed at all uh, with the openings. I think they've been really good. I am hashtag blessed that <laughs> that I've gotten some really good pulls here, and I hope you guys have been getting some good pulls yourself. Please do share what you've been getting below and what you still need. It'd be cool to know. Um, so let's see what we go, what we get with these last eight booster packs of rebel clash now if you want to check out these pictures um you can do on my poker collection facebook page oh my god it's sort of holographic over here they've started a new sort of weird jagged type theme with the elite trainer box beginning with sword and shield it's very strange but i do like the sort of touch the the sort of um slight touch here with with the sort of holographicness of it all Anyway, as I was just saying, you can. Oh my gosh! Thank you, Jack913, for following. I'm currently on Twitch, by the way. That gave me such a fright. Oh my gosh! I'm not used to. So I, I do record on Twitch sometimes, but sometimes I don't record on Twitch. Um, but when I am live, I forget about the sound effects, and they scare the life out of me uh, because I'm so used to the quietness here. Anyway, so. Um, if you want to check out the photos, again, pokerlitz.com, uh, go to Facebook uh, from there and you can see them in the May 2020 recordings and see these in detail. Oh my gosh, there's people screaming outside. Um, sorry about that. If there's, if there's noise, it's because the window's open, the fan's on, and everybody's at home. And I think kids are playing outside now and, I'm, and I really kind of want to wave, hey, hey guys, I'm opening Rebel Clash. You can't, can you, just kidding, I won't do that. That's a bit silly, isn't it? Okay, anyway, let's open. I'm, I'm talking too much. You guys know what comes in here. I mean... If you've seen my um, Elite Trainer Collection um, playlist on YouTube, and I do have a playlist, I put everything organized into different playlists, so if you just want to see Elite Trainer boxes, you see it in one. You don't want to see me repeating myself again and again that, oh, it comes with eight booster packs, which is kind of obvious now. So anyway, we've got a lovely little glossy book here. These books are so good. I love these. I wish I kind of use these i think i would as a kid but um i don't now but i still i'm still collecting and hoarding these because i love them oh my gosh look at the gold cards these are so cool oh my gosh this is so exciting okay right and also we've got the um this really cool secret artwork section it's not really secret i'm just being weird um and it comes with each of the booster pack artworks um, I really need to put these together in some sort of collage. It's pretty cool. I love it. 
I don't know what they're doing outside, but they're very loud. I, I mean, I don't mind. I'm not. I sound like a really old man. I don't mind them making noise. I'm just actually curious as to what they're doing that um, requires them to be so loud. Are they playing hide and seek or something? I don't know. Anyway, let's check. This is really cool. I wish the image did it justice, but it's like a it's like a golden yellow with this really cool off aqua type or maybe teal sort of color Cooper uh, silhouette with golden shiny um, outlines and I really like this holographic little thing as well I like I like what they're doing with the new boxes but it's just it is very strange these are strange um, boxes to have now because these just don't balance anymore it's like a seesaw all right let's see what we have in here oh oh excuse me that was really that was really really too enthusiastic <laughs> I've got a this is a new thing this is actually quite new so this is a Pokemon trade card trading card game rules booklet like as if it's in a theme deck well that's cool lazy eating yep that sounds like me yep I need to focus that, that me um, interesting. Okay, so this is pretty cool. This is very useful to, to have for someone. Um, that's awesome. So they've added this little thing. I don't think that they've... They didn't have it for the Sword and Shield set. Um, we also have this really cool dice. So here we've got the dice. Um, we've got it sort of... It's got the symbol there. I've got to manually focus now, which sucks, but I think it's probably better than the autofocus because sometimes that sort of spazzes out. Um, and then we've got the the yellow dice here. Very bright colours. Sorry, my, my fat thumbs are like super like massive. Okay, I'll put that in there. And then we've got damage counters. You guys see this, but I mean, I mean, if you want to see it, just again. We've got the poison and the burn. Burn. Okay, and. Let's let's open Sesame this up. Cool little backdrop there. So we've got eight booster packs, which we're gonna open shortly. Excitement right there. Let's see if we get a gold. Um, and uh, yes, so we've got the dividers. Da -da. And we've got the energy cards. Energy card pack. Woo! A TCG co card. And very pale yellow looking um, sleeves, which don't exactly match as much as the as the gold, but I guess they should have, I don't know. That's cool. Anyway, I love sleeves. <coughs> I used to love these sleeves because they're just, I could do my, I always like to use these sleeves as the rares for each set, but then my OCD kicked in way too much and it wasn't very healthy. And also, I couldn't actually fit them in properly, so it didn't really work out. Um, ideally, I would have liked to use each set sleeve for each each set, but um, that's just that's just asking for too much stress. <laughs> okay, guys, that leaves us with the eight booster box, eight booster boxes, no, eight booster packs. Gosh, what am I doing? All right, let's go. Um, let me know what your favorite ETB. I mean, ever since Plasma Storm, ever since I opened Plasma Storm, which was the first trial run of Elite Trainer boxes, I've loved them. But I'm keen to know, what is your favourite Elite Trainer Box design of all time? Let me know the set that you like the most in the comments below. Okay, I think the focus is okay. Right, we've got Psychic Energy, Charger Bug, Metapod, Burning Scarf, Grubbin. Ooh, I haven't, I've not seen Grubbin very much. Electabuzz, Natu, Honedge, Impudimp, an Aracuda Reverse, and a Galarian Rune Rigus. Okay, so we've got uh, Steel Energy, Charger Bug, Skunk Tank, Full Heal, Electabuzz, Squovert, Snova, Natu, Trubbish, Galarian Weezing Reverse. I still haven't received the rare version of that, I don't think. And Galarian Mr. Rhyme. Okay, right, so we've got a Water Energy Lombre. Howlucha, Indeedee, Stuffle, Lotad, Growlithe, Roly Coley, Meditite, Luxio Reverse, and a Mandibuzz Rare. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're getting louder out there. It's like, okay, don't panic, guys. 
pattern before. We have got a Darkness Energy, Palpitoad, Scoop Up Net, Chatot, Electabuzz, a Natu, Hone Edge, Impidimp, Magma, a Tool Scrapper Reverse. Oh, yes! An Inteleon V. I was going to say Reverse, but it's not Reverse. It's just an Inteleon V. <laughs> nice. That's pretty cool. I like that. I don't think I've actually got much Inteleon. I love Inteleon. Because I love Sobble. Alright. So we've got Grass Energy, Polossand, Milo, Turfield Stadium, Scrobert, Glaring Mr. My Rhyme, Mr. Mime, sorry, <laughs> Catsby, Barboach, oh! Aracuda, now we've got Glaring Mr. Rhyme, Reverse, Rare, and a Greedent. Come on, at least give me one more rainbow or something. Something would be cool. Okay, so we've got a Electric Energy, Tranquil, a Medicham, Morgrum, Lotad, Growl Growlith, Growlith, Roly Coly, Meditite, Grubbin, a Shuckle, so, so cute, reverse, and oh nice, an Ice Skew, Hollow. Not bad. I feel like Hollows are just so much more rarer now. <laughs> They're just a lot less common. I wish, I wish they kind of made hollows slightly more common if they're going to make more ultra rares and stuff, you know? Because, hello. Alright, second to last pack. So we've got Fighting Energy, Beware. Um, Speed Electric Energy, Pelipper. Galarian Darumaka, Bonalby, Volpix, Phantump, Galarian Farfetched, a Bronzor Reverse, and a Ninetales Rare, which leaves us with one more pack, you guys. It's a Rillaboom pack. Fingers crossed for something, something cool in this to finish off. Some last pack magic would be appreciated. Destiny, sorry, world, universe, whatever. Please give us something cool. Okay, so we've got a fire energy, Carcol, Heatmore, a Zatu, Galarian Mr. Mime, Caterpie, Barboach, Aracuda, a Stuffle, Flapple, Rare Reverse, and an Aegislash Rare to end that Elite Trainer box. So the Elite Trainer box wasn't that spectacular. Um, I think the booster boxes set me up for like greatness that beating the booster boxes this time around was just not going to happen. But we still got a V, we still got a Hollow, and some awesome artwork in there as well. I'm keen to know what your favourite card was in this comment below. In, in, sorry, in this video. Please comment below. Terrible English. I don't know what's going on. This is the cue for me to leave. Um, but uh, yes, it's been a good time. And even though I didn't get a gold, I did get a holographic gold in the form of this ETB, which is great. Um, until next time, guys. See you soon. And keep an eye out for more live streams as well. I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Write it down. Yeah.